Hi guys, got a request from Yahia Emara to make an RC boat out of foam plates. Well, unfortunately, due to a stocking error, I'm out of stock of uh, foam plates. I've got some foam cups and some foam dishes, but I've got no plates. So I've got an idea for making a sort of a boat using some of these foam dishes. I'm thinking of using four of them. A bit like a, a pond skater uh, insect that stands on the water. Spreads its feet out and the surface surface tension stops his feet sinking into the water. Now this is not going to be exactly like one of them but I was thinking of using the four of these spread out as the hull of the boat uh, and either use barbecue skewers or uh, styrofoam or something to link them together. Actually barbecue skewers might look nice. So that will be the boat, and then to power it, I'm going to take apart my old radio controlled, or actually it's infrared controlled plane that I made from the parts from a helicopter. So that's the receiver and the infrared uh, receiver. There's also a little LiPo battery sitting in there. Then we've got two propellers, or two motors. Those are the ones that were in the helicopter. So I'll just mount them up on a structure here somewhere, up, up in the air, so they can blow the boat forwards and backwards and turn it. Well, actually, they don't do backwards. They just do forwards, so forwards and turn. Just had a quick look in my box there and I've got some drinking straws so I think I'll use them instead of barbecue skewers to link it together. I've marked up the dishes so that I've got the four quarters marked. I've got a sharpened metal tube here that I'm using to cut a little hole through. It's about the same size as the drinking straw. I should just hot glue them in position. I've got four drinking straws and four styrofoam dishes. Motors in place on little styrofoam, uh, I suppose you could almost call them rudders, although they don't do anything, they just support the motors. Got it on charge, it's one of these little helicopter uh, infrared transmitters that has the inbuilt charger. So that's charging up the LiPo that's attached to the receiver. I'll probably put a bit of um, blue tack or something on there to hold it in place so it doesn't fall off into the water. And when that's charged up, we'll give it a little try in the bath. Uh, not much point taking this to a boating lake or anything, so I think it'll just blow away in the wind. It's really not enough space to demonstrate whether it can turn or not. I don't think we're going to be able to see whether it can actually turn. I 
wonder if I can rig something up that will hold it still and we can see if it can turn. I've now got it anchored, got some lead weights on the back there, on the bottom of the bath. So there we go. That's our radio controlled boat from Styrofoam Dishes with motors and receiver and LiPo battery from a small uh, remote controlled helicopter. So the steering is actually the variable thrust between the two motors, making it turn left or right. I think this would be fine on a swimming pool or something like that. But it's very lightweight, so out in my normal boating pond, it just get blown away. So, job done.